We continue our Go Girls series, but this time with something sweet. I mean, uh, this is really going to inspire. One local woman decided after college to take the entrepreneurial route, cotton candy style, but with a new spin. Jasmine Monroe has the story. What's so fun is that it's great for kids and it's nostalgic for adults, but then to put that adult spin on it with orange bourbon and champagne, I mean, it's really the best of both worlds. <laughs> Typically, when you see cotton candy, you think back to carnivals and county fairs, but for Emily Harple, she put her own spin on things. We do gourmet cotton candy on the spot for you and your guests. Freshly married in 2016 with graduate school plans on hold, the art of sucre, which means sugar in French, was created on the drive back from her honeymoon. On the way back from my honeymoon, I looked over at my husband who we were driving back from Florida, and I said, I have this idea. And he looked at me and he goes, do it. That sounds great. Fast forward four years later, not only is business booming, but it's spun into something even more than just weddings. We work a lot um, with the cabs, and we're in their suites frequently. We've done the Elton John concert. We work a lot of, you know, big, great businesses in Cleveland. We also do kids' birthday parties. We do store openings, really anything that you can think of, we've probably done. You see, she took a traditional childhood treat and gave it a chic upgrade. Adults love it, kids love it and you get to pick your flavors, you get to pick the color that your flavor is. You have toppings like Pop Rocks and glitter and cookie crumble, all of the things that you could really want in a dessert. But she says business isn't always sweet. Obviously we get to do really amazing and cool things, but it's non-stop work. Her advice to aspiring entrepreneurs? Follow your intuition and go at your own pace, but at least do something, get started. So we had so much fun with Emily. We had to bring the cotton candy girl here ourselves. Emily, what is it that you love so much about doing this, honestly? I mean, you cannot be, have anything but a great time while making cotton candy. Yeah. yeah, it's just so fun and so many childhood memories. All right, so I brought some friends to the party. I hope that's okay. Perfect. Dave and Holly, I was bragging about the champagne, and this is something sweet. So can you show us how this works? Sure, absolutely. So you're going to go ahead and take your Okay. And then take your cotton candy, and okay. you can either, there's two ways to do it. Okay. You can either take it off and just eat it straight, or how I recommend is actually pushing it into the wine, and the cotton candy will dissolve, the okay. glitter's gonna I'm doing out. what you recommend. Oh, <gasps> look at that. That's so Did pretty. Oh, and look at the glitter. Oh my gosh, <laughs> are we getting the glitter? <laughs> Cheers. Oh my yes, goodness, cheers. this is all for the party. All right, Emily, for more information, how can folks find you and have a cotton candy party? Because oh, it's, so it's for anything. It's for anything. It's kids, adults. It's really good. Um, it's www.artofsucra.com. All of our social media handles are the same as well, Art of Sucra. All right, so Austin's talking about Punchy, and we have cotton candy. I hey, Emily, you had me a glitter, yeah, okay? Yes. <laughs> I can eat punchkies at the desk, which I've oh, done, and, and then a, wash it down. It literally like glitter cascaded everywhere. onto your face in the most beautiful way. And Jasmine course, always looks beautiful. She does. I mean, and then I, now we just cotton candy. Yeah, no, I mean, and, everything and I said you that do to her, like everything, she's <laughs> match, she matches purpose. the cotton candy. <laughs> Match the cotton candy. <laughs> I can't even with you. That is so funny. You're beautiful, <laughs> Emily. You so continuing great. Thank success. You for being in. I'm so happy for you. Cheers. Yes. Cheers to all of you, and cheers to getting our kids out to that bus stop this morning.